How many people are actually going to see this movie this weekend? People Like Us is a brother sister drama that comes out in the middle of the summer, the same weekend as Seth MacFarlane's directorial debut that, that's about a cursing teddy bear, a comedy drama about Channing Tatum's abs, and the latest Tyler Perry Drek. Good luck making your budget back on this one. Now, while I haven't seen Magic Might just yet, that review will be coming tomorrow, I have to say that I think this is the movie to see this weekend. Chris Pine plays Sam, a young 20-something who got into a little bit of trouble at work, and he's in a lot of debt. Elizabeth Banks plays Frankie, who is a struggling single mother with a troubled son that needs a break. These two are brother and sister, but they just don't know it yet, and the only thing they have in common is a father who just passed away. Sam, who actually got to have his dad around as a kid, is left with his money that he could really use, but he's told but he's told he has to give it to a sister that he doesn't know and her son. Needless to say, he struggles with this decision and that's mainly what the movie is about. Him trying to get to know his sister without him telling her who, she, who he is. And the longer he keeps this up, the more pissed she's going to be when she finds out that that's her brother. Now this movie has a bit of a tight rope to walk with the whole brother-sister thing. They're both attractive people. Chris Pine knows he can't do anything with her, but Elizabeth Banks is a struggling single mother who has this nice single dude helping her out so you can't help but think that she might be falling for him to at least some degree so there is some of that tension at times but thankfully the movie never gets creepy with it in the background you have Michelle Pfeiffer who is great in this movie as Chris Pine's mom and she has some secrets of her own you also have Olivia Wilde who is great in this the best performance she's ever given in my opinion and the kid Elizabeth Banks' son in the movie he wasn't annoying and what you have here is a well-acted, well-shot drama that's not Oscar bait. It's an honest movie that might be a little smalty at times, but it's not falling in that, into any trappings. It's simply, here's the story we wanted to tell, hope you enjoy it, and to be honest, I really did. Surprisingly enough, this was done by one of the guys that wrote Transformers, Star Trek, and Cowboys and Aliens, Alex Kurtzman, and I, I think he did a pretty good job on this, directing this. I think People Like Us is totally worth seeing in theaters at any price, and seriously, good luck to you guys making that budget back. And if you like this review and you want to see more, please subscribe to see more.